I'm Tori Cooper, and here are some of the stories making headlines locally. The manhunt for the alleged cop killer Gustavo Perez Arriaga coming to an end right here in Kern County. The Kern County Sheriff's deputies taking Arriaga into custody just 24 hours ago near Lamont. The small town of Newman, just three hours from Bakersfield, mourning Corporal Singh, who was shot and was just one of 12 officers on the force. The community of Newman coming together for a candlelight vigil. That vigil was held in the downtown plaza and was still adorned with Christmas decoration. I was blessed with knowing Officer Singh. He's an unbelievable person, always happy, always smiling, always joyful, joking around, doing a job he absolutely loved. The vigil for Corporal Singh bringing thousands from Newman and surrounding areas. Family and friends remembering Singh serving the department for seven years. His wife, five-month-old son and dog Sam in attendance. The Stanislaus Sworn Deputies Association has set up an account to donate to Corporal Singh's family. That information can be found on the Stanislaus County Sheriff Department's Facebook page. Newman's chief of police told the crowd that there would be a memorial service for Corporal Singh in early January. We are going to switch gears now and check in with 23ABC's Emma Lockhart. Yeah, we have that hard freeze warning that is in effect now until 10 a.m. tomorrow. Some of those temperatures dipping below freezing. You want to make sure that you bring your pets and seven sensitive plants indoors. Protect exposed water pipes and maybe protect, cover some of that vegetation because unprotected vegetation is at risk. Some of that frost could damage those plants. As for those temperatures you can expect today, those highs here in the valley, low to mid 50s, 54 as that high here in Bakersfield, valley winds calm today. A little bit more breezy in our Mount community, some of those wind gusts reaching 30 miles per hour in the Fraser Park area, highs in Fraser Park reaching 47, 45 up in Dehachapi and 53 up in Lake Isabella. As for those mountain communities, you guys will be in those low 50s and we are seeing sunny skies across the valley today as well as the county and those temperatures will remain in those 50s throughout the week. And that's a look at what's making headlines this morning. We'll have another update for you later today.